Hey Dave, this is Brian with Taylor & Son Chevrolet in Sandpoint slash Ponderay, Idaho. Uh, here we're going to shoot a little walk around, little up close and personal video on the 2012 Ram 3500 Cummins Turbo Diesel Crew Cab Long Box. Big old truck here for you. Um, generally when I start these videos off, first thing I like to do is walk around the vehicle and maybe show you any imperfections or any little marks or nicks or scuffs or anything like that that you might want to be aware of before making the trip over from somewhere say like the Tri-Cities area and uh, what I found with this vehicle is that walking around it I really am having a hard time finding anything really to point out for you things in great shape uh, as to be expected with a vehicle that's only got 17,000 miles on it um, the customers that traded this into us towards the purchase of a dual rear wheeled uh, vehicle. Um, they're just the kind of people that take meticulous care of their uh, automobiles. So, and that was apparent, you know, in the condition that we received this vehicle. Um, so, like I said, walking around it, there, you know, as far as surface scratches or scuffs or nicks or dings or anything, I really can't find anything to really point out for you. Um, you can walk around here and see that the uh, tires are in a great shape here still um, and even if you kind of dip down in there it's really uh, you see the lack of there's no corrosion or anything that you kind of look for in these vehicles um, no magnesium chloride staining on the wheels uh, which is a problem we have in this area if people don't keep their vehicles clean the chemicals that we use on the road um, you know, really just a good looking truck all the way around here. Um, I was going to open the tailgate here for you and so you could at least see the turnover ball already installed there in the back of it. You know, you're looking at a vehicle here with a tow rating fifth wheel of about 16,450 pounds. Uh, payload just north of 2,800 pounds. Fifth wheel wiring provisions or your plugs already uh, attached in there. Uh, you'll see there, rear view camera and the lock and tailgate. Bully step for the uh, conventional hitch back there so you can get in and out a little bit easier to bed. Um, and the customer actually added in this uh, chrome locking uh, fuel cap cover. A nice little addition there, it does stand out, makes a you know, little added accent to the vehicle. But I'm going to open the inside of the cab here. And uh, man, the thing just, it's like, it, it's brand new. <laughs> it's really all I can tell you. Got your integrated trailer brake control there, along with your headlight selector. You see your power adjustments for your seats. There's your manual settings for, or excuse me, your uh, memory settings for driver one, driver two. Hop up here in the seat real quick, kind of go through. You do have full function navigation here. Um, and you'll see all the different selections you've got. There's your diesel exhaust, brake tow, haul mode, traction control, hazard, um, your on off switch for your power inverter here, 110 power outlet. Um, heated and air conditioned front seats uh, as, long as, as well as a heated steering wheel. One thing you do get in these Dodge pickups that you can't get in Chevrolet or Toyota or anything, you actually have rear heated seats as well for your back seat passengers um, and then you have your power sliding rear window you see here's your controls for it right up here in the top by the dome light um, you also have your universal home remote there so you can program up to three garage doors um, and then one other thing to point out you do have alpine sound in here it does a you know, I'm a kind of a sound and a music guru the radio in this thing is pretty nice um, really overall uh, as far as condition is concerned trying to show you anything on the inside that you might need to know there's just nothing to show you and the thing's just darn clean um, it you know it, it looks like it just came off a showroom floor in here so um, as always if you have any questions you can contact myself or Lauren Ellis here at the dealership uh, the phone number here is 208-263-2138. And again, my name is Brian Jacobs. Of course, you can call me uh, at any time or you can get in touch with Lauren. And uh, 
we'll be happy to answer any more questions for you. Uh, we appreciate your interest in this uh, truck, and we hope to hear from you very soon. Have a great one.